Hey. What are you doing? What are you looking for, huh? What are you, some kind of weirdo? Some kind of perv? What do you... Oh! It's a video. It's about a Polish singing competition where the contestants have to sing and also perform just like the musicians. And blackface. Oh, what? Hello everybody, welcome to Goose Juice. I'm your host, Talani. Take a seat, relax, put your feet up. We're gonna be talking about the magnum opus of talent and singing shows in Poland. Poland, the home of the biggest castle, one of the oldest salt mines, and vodka. That's right, that's right, you thought vodka was Russian. <laughs> We gotta, we gotta watch out for these Russians. They're getting, they're getting very crafty. I'm telling you, they're up to something. They're claiming that they invented vodka? Baloney. Phony baloney. No good with the war. No good with the claiming that they invented vodka. Next, they were telling you they invented Chinese food and world peace. Oh, you want to be friends, huh? <laughs> Wait a tick. Peace. But what a lovely land. What a lovely people. Just beautiful. I, I I don't know. I've I've never actually been there before. You lie! You're a fucking liar! But like a person who's trying to convince the entire crowd that I'm not a fucking racist, I actually have Polish friends. I'm good friends with a lot of Polish people and Eastern European people. And to the Polish brethren that I have out there, test. But with all that being said, <clears throat> what the hell is that? In this great future, you can't forget your past. So hard makes me sick. Stop that, you're white. Your face sounds familiar. <coughs> that's that's the name of the uh the show. I just thought I might give it a bit of a dramatic flip. But also in Polish, it's. As if I'm gonna try and pronounce that. Humble beginnings for the show. It started back in 2014 and it was actually named something different called Sing Your Face Off. And it only lasted one season. I'm not sure why. Sings his face off as Nicki Minaj! The premise of the show was very simple. All you had to do was perform, sing, rap, and act. Acting. Like the person that you're pretty much impersonating down to a T, right down to the makeup, which kind of makes me think, how how does how is that down to the contestant to win the show? I, I That's the last question that's on my mind about this. That's not important right now. But they soon encountered what I'd assume most people in the West would consider a problem. What if the person they have to imitate is black. Poland has a population of about what 38 million and the most of the population is what 98% white so uh, you're gonna run into some problems when you want to get into some no, darker God. skin performers right? But it's quite evident that the producers at least of the show didn't really consider this to be a problem they just spearheaded forward just went right forward and continued to do so to this day which is why I'm talking about this video right now. 2021 they had a contestant who impersonated Kanye West Lips and all oh before being stronger. Let's get lost tonight. You could be a blessed lost tonight. You can't Let's give it the boss tonight. You don't give up what they all say right. But you can imagine that with a lot of people at the time, especially in this very modern and accepting age that we live in, that went down like a lead balloon. And the Polish edition of the show's creators was surprised, which you could argue is pretty surprising in and of itself. Anyway, this season's winner, Kuber, I'm not gonna attempt that. Kuba Szmajkowski. Filmed himself wearing cornrows and donning blackface to impersonate and look like the GOAT Kendrick Lamar. Oh, this nigga's not black? No. No. Well, he's, he's, yeah, he's white. He's doing blackface? Oh my God. But this transformation that he filmed of himself and put on Instagram for some fucking reason is the most tone deaf thing you could ever see in your fucking life. Sit down. 
the singer went too far with his performance as he hit the stage wearing blackface makeup and fake braids while also opting not to censor the use of the N-word within the song. I mean, sweet Jesus, whose idea was this? And what's kind of crazy to me is how often this keeps happening, how often this keeps cropping up. I mean, this is Snoop Dogg and Missy Elliott in the Mongolian version. Like it's hard. Pop it like it's hard. Pop it like it's hard. And if a nigga get an attitude, pop it like it's hard. You what? I mean, honestly, I, I starting this video, I was gonna say, well, you know, at least the makeup's okay. At least, at least they do a good job at trying to make them look like, like exactly the people that they are. And this is barring the mind fuck that is, you know, the blackface situation. But the more you look closer at it, the more you're kind of like, I don't like it. I don't like to think about it. <laughs> it's, it's... But honestly, even with that, if you look at the makeup that's on the people, it just looks so fucking weird. Look, the reality of it is, I don't mind the show. Okay, it's, it's, it's. Stop the cap. Okay, no, this show is terrible. I mean, like the the performances are just dog shit. Kasiu, zapraszam cię do windy. To jest Katarzyna Skrzynecka. A już za moment. To będzie Louis Armstrong. He can't keep getting away with it. I have no idea to what end this is for. Aside from bigging up the makeup artists, and even then, their their work isn't. I'm not a makeup artist, but I uh, look at it. Uh, look at it. Even with that being said, it's only as brain cancer inducing as much as all these other shows are. You know, you have the mass singer. My parents made a lot of sacrifices for me. They uprooted their entire lives just so I could live my dreams, and I wouldn't be here without them. So tonight, this performance is a thank you for their unconditional love. <laughs> You have the mask Phantom, you have the mask with Jim Carrey, I don't know man. Where are you going with this? I'm losing my mind. It's one of those X Factor, American Idol, whatever singing type shows. And that's fine, that's funny. The gimmick about them having makeup is all groovy. As long as it's done tastefully. Now the main problem area is up here. All of this going on up here is what's causing me the most physical discomfort. Why? Come, you gotta assume somebody's offended at that. If not for the craftsmanship, for the racial element, for the love of Christ. But I don't know, man. You know, different places, different cultures. I'm, I'm, so, I'm so tired. If you like this video, hey, consider subscribing. Maybe liking it. Maybe giving your mother a kiss on the forehead for me. Mom, I love you. It's a cold and desolate, lonely world out there. You're born alone and you die alone. Anyway, till then. I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.